Hey guys, uh, welcome to your energy checking for Scorpio. This is going to be for April 2022. So we're going to take a look at your over energies, what's surrounding you guys, what you guys need to know, what you guys could expect for April. And then we will see what the possible outcome and advice are. So um, this could be in anything. Uh, you, uh, and you could also apply this to any replacements, okay? Um, so... Uh, you can apply this to your own unique situation, switch the rules if you want. If there's more than one person showing up in the read, keep in mind that these are general messages. Take what resonates and leave the rest behind. If this message didn't resonate, take a look at your other placements. Uh, if you guys haven't done so yet, hit the subscription button and the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post. Um, give this video a thumbs up like this video so that this message can circulate around to the individuals that need to hear this uh share this video with someone if you feel like there's someone out there that you know that needs to hear this leave a comment down in the comment section below if this message resonates uh, for those of you guys that are interested in booking a private personal reading with me the link for that is in the description box below all right scorpio let's get started over energies for scorpio what is surrounding scorpio what does Scorpio need to know? What can Scorpio expect for April 2022? And like I said, since this is anything that's in specific, you can apply this to any of your placements, okay? All right, uh, let's see what we have here. All right, we have the Page of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, okay? Could be dealing with another Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. Um, I don't know. Someone here is dealing with some sort of fears here. Fears about reaching out to someone here, okay? Um, you know, there could also be fears stemming back to someone's childhood here too, okay? So let's see what else we have here. The Lovers and the Ace of Swords. Okay. Gemini energy. Could be dealing with a Gemini here. You might have Gemini in your chart. The Four of Swords and the Ten of Cups. Seems like someone here is scared to approach someone. This could be regarding to a connection here, a relationship. Yeah, you know, someone here has fears about approaching someone. Because I feel like someone here is scared that they might mess this up. So I'm feeling like, you know, someone here is in their head about this a lot. Okay. Uh, what else do we have here? What else do we have here? Tell me about the Page of Cups. Page of Cups. Seven of Wands and the Eight of Swords. And the Five of Cups here. Someone here is really, really, really guarded, okay? So I feel like someone here is holding back, okay? Someone here is dealing with some sort of regret here. Maybe someone here is feeling like we're scared that they might mess up, okay? Seven of Wands and the Five of Cups. Okay. Tell me about the lovers. Why are the lovers here? Ten of Wands, Ace of Swords, and the Seven of Cups. We have someone here that's going through a lot. I don't know if someone here is feeling like this uh, this connection is a burden here. Or that someone here has like overwhelming emotions towards someone. I mean, we have someone here that could have been seeking other options or that they were confused, but now they're clear about what they want. Four of Swords. Temperance. Ten of Cups. And the King of Pentacles. Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. OK, 
King of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, Temperance, Sagittarius, Energy here. We have someone here that could be going through some sort of healing here. And this is this healing is in regards to someone's childhood, someone's family, okay? Yeah, I feel like we have someone here that seems to be confused about maybe a love situation or maybe confused about someone's feelings towards each other, but I feel like it's becoming more clear, okay? So let's see what else we have here. Outcome and advice here for Scorpio regarding their uh, situation for the month of April 2022. What else does um, Scorpio need to know? flipped out of my hand in the four of cups someone here is really in their head really in the, their emotions right now wondering if they should stick around or walk away seems like someone here is working really hard on their stability and their happiness or that someone here is trying to fix a relationship trying to put effort into a relationship here but I also feel like someone here is going through some sort of healing here too. Having some sort of major mental breakthrough here. Um, let's see what else we have here. Seven of Swords and the Knight of Cups. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Seems like someone here is scared of messing up or scared of sabotaging something here, okay? Also, someone here is definitely not living their true authentic life because there's something that someone wants to do here, but they're not doing it. Um, with the King of Wands and then the Ace of Pentacles here. Someone here is looking for a fresh new beginning here, I feel. Perhaps trying to avoid the drama, okay? Focusing on happiness, focusing on healing here. Um, Eight of Cups, Queen of Cups, Four of Cups, and the Emperor here, Aries Energy. So this is you right here. This is you thinking about someone. This is you wanting an opportunity to hear with someone. Or either you could walk, be walking away from someone and someone here is trying to come back because they're bored. I mean, there are three masculine energies here. So I'm wondering if all these people are the same people. It seems like you have a decision to make between a few, op few options here. Let me see what else we have here. Seven of Swords, Knight of Pentacles, Knight of Cups, and the Nine of Pentacles, Virgo, ener Virgo energy, pre-Empress energy here. Seems like the people that are surrounding you are people that you don't trust. So I don't know if there's also an energy of you wanting to just be by yourself right now and focusing on your career, uh, your pentacles here, your money. Okay, tell me about this King of Swords. That's not the King of Swords, King of Wands. Six of Cups, oh, Ace of Pentacles, Five of Swords. Someone here is coming back to win you back at all costs here, I feel. Okay, someone here is looking for a new beginning. So there's an X in the picture here that's trying to come back. So I'm feeling like the, these two kings and, and this emperor is the same people. So someone here has fears about approaching you, okay? And yeah, someone here might be coming back in from the cold for breaking your heart, okay? So Scorpio, I hope that uh, this was helpful. I hope this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Share this video. Like this video if you haven't done so yet. Subscribe. Hit the notification bell. And I will speak to you guys in the next one. All right. Thanks, guys.